Good morning, everyone. It's Monday morning and we have a box opening. I am getting ready to open this baby. I only opened the one flap. The address label is taped to the box. So, but other than that, um, we will discover it together. And I have Tegan here with me because she is made by the same artist. So this is her, you know, reborn sister. I will be taking her out probably and putting the new baby in the bassinet. Um, move this basket bassinet to open her, I think. But first we'll take a look in the box. Let me just move this out of frame a little bit. All right. How's that? Pretty good, right? I'm going to try and sit kind of like off to the corner here to create as little of a shadow as possible. <laughs> Sorry, my feet are in every video these days. What is going on? All right. So, of course, if you know, Tegan is made by Holly Cook of Moon River uh, Nursery. And so this baby is from her. First thing I see here is a book. She sends such cute things. So this is the Wonky Donkey, a scholastic book. Tegan came home with an elephant book. All right, we've got a COA here and a card. Thank you. Thank you again for adopting this baby. I hope you love her as much as I did. She really is the best sculpt, Holly. And I shared in a previous video that this will be the fourth version of this sculpt I've had, and I've loved them all. Truly, truly have loved them all. Uh, all right. Got stickers and a hair bow and a diaper and some um, Wonder Wafers, baby powder scent. Nice, they're like holog holographic stickers. I've got um, cone flowers and mushrooms and more little mushrooms. I have to do something with my stickers. I love them so much. All right. Oh, this is a belly plate. I can feel that. Move that out of the way. Everything looks really beautiful. Look at this wrapping paper. I love the floral, I really do. Oh, and it looks like she's wrapped up in the floral swaddle blanket that was in her photos. Literally, I saw one photo of this baby like 11 minutes after it was posted. I ran over to Holly's um, reborns.com site, saw the baby and bought it. Like, it's like, this baby will not last. This is really pretty, H&M sleeper. Really pretty. Size newborn, European size 56. Okay, I see Kate Quinn. Oh, I love this. <laughs> and actually, I'm pretty sure that I was gifted something with another Kate Quinn with a dinosaurs uh, for Amity. So that'll be fun. The two girls can be in their dino um, rompers. They, another beautiful floral sleeveless bodysuit. This one is Old Navy, zero to three months, which I remember the sculpt also fits well. And this is Simple Joys by Carter Sleep Sack. Isn't that pretty? So on here, the print, uh, they are little swans, if you can see that. Little itty bitty swans all over. Really beautiful. Okay, I think that we have, oh, we have one more. One more thing, this is a box in here. Pretty paper, look at the pretty flowers. I've come to appreciate florals in my old age. Okay, this is taped up pretty good. So I think, 
I'm going to defy my natural tendency to pick at it for 20 minutes in, in stubbornness and just use my scissors. Okay. And then we'll just throw those to the ground. What is this? Oh my goodness. How cool is this? Okay. It looks like a music box. Or a jack in the box. Nope. <laughs> Moon River, which of course her nursery name. How Adorable and brilliant is that. Okay, I'm obsessed. <laughs> I'm obsessed. All right. Okay, it's baby time. So let's do our little shuffle. Move the box over. Take our beautiful Tegan. Okay. Get those scissors off the ground here and just <clears throat> cut the tape. I'm just gonna cut the whole thing open like a, it's like a like a cocoon, chrysalis. <sighs> okay, she has been burned. <laughs> Very soft swaddle blanket. She's a beautiful weight. Look at the flora on flora. There's something oddly satisfying about that. Oh, I love this blanket she's in. Thank you for including it, Holly. This is beautiful. I don't think it will take a lot of you long, well, some of you already know who she is. If you went over and checked or you follow Holly. Oh my gosh. Presentation is, I'm gonna stay over here. Presentation's awesome. I think we can come a little closer. Now that I got us set up high, let me just change it. All right. We are batting a thousand. Look at this beautiful corduroy outfit. Okay, first, look at these striped socks. Let's check out her little feet. Can you see the painting? These little fat feet I love so much. Another fat little foot. Of course, you know, I'll give you a close up once she's all unwrapped. And I see 
we'll have to take this whole thing off of her to really get a look at her painting, but very beautiful. So far, so good. Look at that. So pretty, so like elegant. There's an elegance about Holly's babies and the presentation. I said that in my pictures of Tegan yesterday. She's elegant. And that would be probably the biggest adjective that I would. So texture on the hands. Yep. So I know that she, this had been, there's two kinds of varnish on her. And I think this was during the time of transitioning out of the Genesis brand paints. I can't remember exactly, so I don't want to misquote but there were some experimental techniques with the stall. I love her. Do you, you guys have to recognize this. If you're very familiar with sculpts, you'll recognize this hand, these two hands. Her painting's beautiful. It's really beautiful. The texture is definitely different than anything I've experienced for sure, but I really, I'm digging it. I love texture, some kind of texture, please. This is wonderful. All right, let's see her face. Oh, I'm so excited for this baby. <gasps> She's breathtaking. She's breathtaking, Holly. Oh my gosh, so it's Lulu, obviously Lulu. If you, um, I know not everybody that watches is very familiar, but Lulu by Joanna K. Kazmierczak. Oh my gosh, she's gorgeous. First of all, look how cute she is in her bonnet. Look how this bonnet is tied. This is the most beautiful outfit. We might have to take her out of the bassinet to get an unshadowed view of her. I don't know, we're gonna see. I can't even, I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't even seen her head. Oh, she's amazing. She has painted hair. She has a little peach fuzz on her face applied. She has these little freckles. Oh my gosh, she is unbelievable. What can I, I think I'm gonna borrow Tegan's elephant to put under her head to prop her up. Holy cow. I've seen a lot of babies, so you know that they get, <clears throat> and you've seen me open a lot of them. I don't always have the same kind of like a breath, breathtaking reaction, which is never a reflection of the, the beauty of the artist's work, but okay. See if I can do this right for you. Look. Maybe I can zoom a little. Look. Wow. I'm just gonna turn the camera like this for a second. I don't even know what to say other than I am completely wowed by this baby. Completely. She is unbelievably perfect. Okay. Let's see her little purple tones on her feet, maybe. If I can. Oh, let me go back out to one. Oops. 
<laughs> I'm going to tap her foot instead of the camera to change focus. Her little feet and her nails. Holy smokes. The hair painting is gorgeous. And somebody mentioned in one of the reviews on Facebook that I had been trying to say it in my review. She said that like Holly makes you look at sculpts in a new way, you know, because of the different things that she does. Wow, wow, wow. Can, sorry, I keep turning the camera. I'm actually snapping photos. <laughs> I'm so in love with her. She's so freaking perfect. I'm going to try and put you guys back up here on the, on the phone stand tripod selfie stick thing. Let's just look at her COA real quick and her belly plate. So, we need the scissors again. I love Lulu's belly plate too. So there's her belly plate. Obviously a, a great match on skin tone. <laughs> like they're like a like a meat flap. <laughs> it's not picking up as well as her face is, but there you go. So gorgeous. Look at the belly button. Really, really beautiful. All right, I'll put that up here for now. We'll grab her COA. She is number 430 out of 2100, hand sculpted by Joanna. All the beautiful versions. We are thrilled. I, I don't know who he is. I am thrilled about this baby. Holly, I'm absolutely blown away by your work and your presentation. I love her. I, I see why you couldn't let her go. I'm very appreciative that um, I was able to bring her to my house when you did finally decide to let her go. Um, 150% thrilled with my decision. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I am uh, positive I'll be back with this girl <laughs> to show you more of her. Um, thank you for joining me. I hope your week is off to a great start. Sending out lots of love. Bye for now. <laughs>